Hi guys, Mark here from Revivorsoft. Today I'm going to teach you how to uninstall a Metro or Modern UI application from Windows 8. Now in a previous video I have shown you how to uninstall a desktop application. If you'd like to find that video, the link to it is in the comments below. So to uninstall a Metro or Modern UI application, you need to get to the start screen. Now there are a couple of ways of doing that. The first way of doing it would be to take your cursor and move it to the top right corner of the screen and then move down or go to the bottom right hand corner of the screen and move up and click on start. Also what you can do is swipe with your finger from the right hand edge of the screen if you have a touch screen device or alternatively you can press the Windows key on your keyboard and it will take you to this screen here which is the Windows 8 start screen. Now this is the Windows replacement of the start menu from previous versions of Windows there's been a bit of controversy over whether this was the right thing to do but if you've upgraded to Windows 8 this is your way to get to different applications so right here you see everything that has a flat color or all these different flat color tiles are Metro or modern UI applications and then all of these applications here that are just little icons for applications that you have installed on the same colored tile are all desktop applications so if you'd like to uninstall a Metro or Modern UI application, what you need to do is right click on the tile. Alternatively, you can also just hold your finger on the tile and you'll get the same menu. And you'll see down in the bottom left hand corner here, you have three options. Unpin from start is to remove it from the screen. Uninstall, which is what we'll get to in a second. And then smaller, which just makes the tile smaller. And then you can also, if, you, if it's a small tile you're clicking on, you'll have the option to make it larger, like that. So to uninstall the tile or the application, all you need to do is right click on it and then click uninstall. And then you just need to confirm and click uninstall again. And there you have it, the application has been removed and it will free up some extra hard drive space so that you can install more applications or perhaps have more pictures or more files on your computer. And if you want to get that application back, all you need to do is go back to the store and look for it and then install it again. So if you have any questions, please leave a comment below in the video comments and we hope to see you in a future Revivorsoft video. Thanks for watching.